What is 340 feet long and 20 feet wide? The answer coming up. So what is 340 feet long and 20 feet wide? It's the transient dock that's under construction at the foot of Broadway along the riverfront. City engineer and public works director Rick Murphy is here to tell me more about this project. And Rick, I used to play with Tinker Toys and I've seen erector sets. That's what this looks like. What is this thing? Actually, Pam, what you're looking at is the frame, the space frame that, that is the structure for the dock itself. Okay. Okay, this, this framing that you'll see will later be covered up with the decking material that everybody will walk on once it's complete. Now this is being constructed at the foot of Broadway, why? Because this is not its final home. It is not. Actually, this, uh, the foot of Broadway this time of year made for an excellent assembly point for the dock itself. Uh, the, the, I guess the shape, the water moving up and down. Uh, allowed the contractor an excellent place to assemble the dock and once it's all assembled they're going to float the whole thing down and put it around the spud poles uh, uh, all at one time. Now what are they having to attach to this dock? It's more than just a frame. There's a lot of, I guess, utilities that have to be attached. Absolutely. We've got gas, diesel, electric, water, sewer pump out, and fire water that's on here. Those are the utilities that are served on there. And you can see those uh, where these blue barrels are. Mm -hmm. That's where all the utility connections will come up underneath the gangway. Okay. And if you look at the blue barrels, the blue barrels are actually filled full of water, okay. uh, simulating the load. If those barrels were not on that, that would be floating real high out of the water. But that's simulating the load from the gangways that's going to sit in that location. Now, what are the final features that a boater is going to enjoy on this? I see the light poles, so we're going right. to have lighting. Right. Final features will include, as a boater comes up, we'll have nine um, pedestals where they'll have electricity to hook their boat up to. They'll have city water to hook to, up to the water for their boat. They'll have a sewer pump out if they need to take off their waste off their boat. And then, uh, of course, obviously, there'll be a place to tie up, and there'll be in inboard and outboard locations to tie up. And we're expecting boaters could start using this this spring? Absolutely. We're looking for we're looking for March, April, but I'm looking more for April because I'm just talking about when boats would be coming by. Okay. Well, thank you, Rick, and thank you so much <laughs> for telling me more about this project. Thanks for joining us. Oh.